Haider Ali. The Vodiyar dynasty, one of the most prominent dynasties of the south, ruled the kingdom of Mysore. Haider Ali and his son Tipu Sultan made their mark in this region. Haider Ali was born at Budi Kot around the year 1720. He started off his career as a soldier. He was a petty officer in the army and was assistant to the Nizam who was the Mughal deputy in South India. When the Nizam was assassinated, a lot of confusion followed and in the midst of all the chaos, Haider Ali's services attracted the attention of Nanjaraj, the minister of the Raja of Mysore. Haider Ali received an independent command and over the next 12 years, the minister and the king depended on him and were under his control. Haider Ali rose in ranks until he replaced the king. He extended his empire right up to the lands in the north beyond the Tungabhadra river. He spent much of his time in building up a strong army to deal with the Marathas in the northwest and the British on the east and west coast. The Marathas waged four damaging wars against Haider Ali, but after the death of their leader, Peshwa Madhav Rao in 1772, Haider Ali sought the friendship of the British so that they could together defeat the Marathas. The British, however, had other ideas and wanted to undermine his powers and use him. This led to the first Anglo-Mysore War in 1767. Haider Ali's campaign against the British proved successful and he got the British to sign a mutual defence treaty with him. The British went back on their word when they were attacked by the Marathas. In 1780, Haider Ali waged his second battle against the British. He was defending his kingdom as best as he could, but then suddenly died of cancer. He was succeeded by his son Tipu Sultan, whom he had educated and trained well. Tipu was fluent in a number of languages and was a good student of mathematics and science. He had a great appetite for learning. He was also an avid reader and his library was filled with over 2,000 books in different languages. Tipu was given exposure to both military and political affairs at a very young age. 